Hello everybody, welcome to Shuckers Wrap Up. I'm your host Thaddeus Cruz and on Saturday night, the Bloxy Shuckers got the fireworks started early against the Birmingham Barons. Second inning scoreless ball game, Tyrone Taylor takes the first pitch of the frame high and deep off the netting in left field on the Kaya Vet and the Shuckers with a quick one to nothing lead over the Barons. Same score, top of the fourth inning. Runners at the corners for the Barons. Hauser in a little bit of a jam here. With one out, Courtney Hawkins with the grounder to short. Noriega tries to start a double play, but throws it into right field. Jake Peters scores from third on the play, and the Barons knot it up at one. Bottom half of the inning, runners at second and third for Noriega, and the newly acquired shortstop redeems himself with a two-run single into center field. Adam Angle comes up throwing home. Nottingham scores on the play as well as Garrett Cooper. Noriega in a rundown gets it's caught for the third out, but not before the two runs cross and the Shuckers back out in front by two after four. Seventh inning, Shuckers still with the 3-1 lead, and Adrian Hauser gets Trey Michalczewski swinging for his eighth strikeout of the game. Hauser would tie a team high with seven innings pitched and come within one of tying a season high of strikeouts, set down eight on strikes on the night. Seventh inning, Noriega with another chance to add some insurance, and he crushes this one in the left field. His first home run as a member of the Biloxi Shuckers and the home team with a three-run advantage at the end of seven. Eighth inning, Tyler Sperlin in a little bit of a jam. Runners at the corners, and he gets Jake Peters swinging for out number two. The very next batter, a one-two pitch, a big curveball gets Pena swinging. Back-to-back -back strikeouts for Sperling gets him out of the eighth inning, and the Shuckers retain their three-run lead. Ninth inning, runners at first and second for Jake Peter against Stephen Colsheen, and the Barons' top hitter lofts this one into shallow right field for a base hit, allowing Keon Barham to score, and the Shuckers' lead is down to just two. Colsheen would be just fine as he strikes out Adam Engel to end the game. Colsheen strikes out the side to earn his his fifth save of the season and secure the Shuckers 4-2 victory over the Birmingham Barons on Saturday night. The combination of Adrian Hauser, Tyler Sperlin, and Stephen Colsheen strike out 13 Barons batters on Saturday. Hauser earns his third win of the season with those seven innings, allows just one run that was unearned on four hits, a walk, and eight strikeouts. Gabriel Noriega in his Biloxi debut goes two for three with that home run, drives in three of the Shuckers' four runs, and also score ones himself. Tyrone Taylor with that homer in the second snaps a 44-game homerless drought by the Shuckers outfielder. Biloxi's win paired with the Pensacola's Blue Wahoo victory over the Montgomery Biscuits on Saturday keeps Biloxi just one game out of first place in the Southern League South Division with eight games remaining in the first half. The Shuckers will look for their second consecutive series victory with a win on Sunday night from MGM Park. Right-handed pitcher Javi Salas takes the mound for your Shuckers. Game time is set for 5-10 p.m. Also fans, just remember, Sunday is an early celebration of Father's Day at the stadium with Little Princess Night. For Shuckers Wrap-Up, I'm Thaddeus Cruz.